welcome to my channel all about decoupage hi i am veronica and today i'm gonna show you how to make a cute nutcracker ornament rustic crackle style so get ready and let's get started for this project i chose styrofoam ball I sent off any imperfections and then I applied one layer of white paint and let it dry. Then I applied this kind of sand beige looking paint all over the ball ornament and of course let it dry again. Then I am using this crackle medium from Pentart. I am applying a good amount of the medium all over the ornament and I let it dry. For better results, don't use any heat gun or hair dryer, just let it dry naturally. After the medium is dry and not sticky, I am using this kind of pale beige paint all over the ornaments. Just make sure when the crackles are appearing, don't go over the same place again because the crackles will disappear. Even here you can see in a short period of time the crackles are appearing already, so let the whole thing dry. If you are a beginner in decoupage, it is better to seal your crackles before applying the napkin, so I am using here matte varnish for it. This way you can be sure you don't ruin your crackles when applying the napkin on your ornament. If you like these kinds of tutorials, please do subscribe to my channel. After the varnish was dry, I am applying the first layer of the napkin with the design on. This time I did cut out the design because I didn't want any white napkin around my design. After everything was dry, I am applying my glitter decoupage glue. Of course, you can skip this step if you don't have glitter decoupage glue. If you do have it, make sure there is no excess because that will dry out white, not clear. After the glue is dry, I am applying the first step of two-step crackle medium from Pentart. Make sure you don't speed up the process of drying just let it dry naturally best overnight don't use any heat gun don't use any hair dryer as you can see it is white but it will dry out clear just let it dry then i am applying the second step of the two crackle medium just let it dry this time you can speed up the process with heat gun or hair dryer. I don't do it, but you can do it if you want to. After it is dry, I am using wax paste to show all the crackles. If there are not enough crackles like you want it, just use a heat gun or hair dryer to more crackles to appear. The only thing with heat gun, make sure you don't melt your styrofoam so be careful with that after all is i am sorry but somehow i lost one step i did seal the ornament with 
varnish but this time you just used really use solvent based varnish not water based then it's time to make our bow i did use my pro bow the hand for it to make a cute little kind of bow don't want to make your ornaments do you want to buy them i do have an etsy shop and you can go check out my etsy shop the link will be in comment the same is the, for the materials i use for this project the last step for this is to applying a little jingle bell onto the ornament so i hot glued one in the front of the ornament and one smaller on the back of the ornament as well then just fluff out the bow and you are all done and finished with a rustic kind of look nutcracker ornament if you have any questions just don't hesitate to comment or contact me I will be more than happy to answer any questions you might have. And here it is all finished, a cute rustic style nutcracker ornament with all crackers on him. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial. If you like it, please do give me a thumbs up or comment how much you like this kind of ornaments. Until next time, bye!